back to another vlog it's maggie if you're new to my channel i'm like sniffly this morning so i apologize i like don't know what's wrong i think i might have like allergies or i'm either getting sick because i've just been like so exhausted from moving and just like lifting so much and unpacking so much i feel like my body's just like so tired um but anyway welcome back to another vlog i am wearing this cozy little pullover that i just got actually from outdoor voices it's so cute and i am obsessed with it so comfy it feels like fall finally here in boston i know we're gonna have a few like warm days the next few weeks but it's been really nice and like crisp and like cozy fall weather i just opened up a package from amazon actually and i wanted to show you guys what i got i ordered this olive oil container which i actually saw in a boutique a few weeks ago and i found it on amazon i'll link it down below it comes in different colors and now that i'm looking at it i'm kind of wish that i got a different color because i'm so used to having like my green big tall green olive oil bottle that i buy from whole foods but the white will do i just feel like this is so much white going on thank god i have my little red olive oil and then i just stocked up the fridge with some coconut water also i just got these new pillows this is the brand right here i'll link them down below these are the pillows that i have on my bed they need to fluff up they take some time to like fluff up because they were just in the box but i wanted to replace my pillows because i read somewhere that you should replace them like every two years and i got mine two years ago so i got new pillows these are my favorite they're so comfy and I love them so much. That's what's up. Milo has been loving just laying. He's been laying like right here in the sun. Hi, you guys. I took allergy medicine, so my eye. My eye is literally swollen. I took allergy medicine, so I don't know what is going on, but the show must go on, and I need to keep... Where are my sunglasses? I need to keep vlogging because I... Wait, no, I lost my sunglasses. Oh, I think I put them up here. But yeah, the show must go on even though I have allergies because I've been on a roll with vlogging and uh, and I've just been like loving being like back at it, like the daily vlogging and stuff. Plus, I feel like I just have a bunch of stuff going on that I want to show and uh, sorry if my voice since I'm all like congested is annoying. I just wanted to say that, but I want to like keep vlogging because i also want to have all these memories and i also love you guys being able to see like every little thing in the process of moving so anyway we're out and about now i just drove to the south end i'm gonna go pick up some lunch and i also have to stop at a few places on the way home just like grocery shopping and we're gonna go to the local butcher i made an iced coffee at home this morning which i didn't have a working ice machine in my freezer at my last place like there was an ice maker it just was broken in the fridge all i wanted to do when i lived there was like make an iced coffee and i never bought ice or like made it in the trays like i just lived without it for a year and i have a working ice machine so i made an iced coffee and it's just the little things like i love making my coffee at home and it's so good i made an iced latte so I'm very happy about that. Um, but yeah, gonna go pick up some lunch right now and do some errands. It's a beautiful day. Like the perfect weather. Perfect, perfect, perfect. You don't need a jacket, but also it's not like super hot. I feel like yesterday was a little bit too hot for me. Like how cute is this area, you guys? These are the apartments. They're like little brownstones. I'm obsessed with it here. Oh. And it's so quiet and quaint. I just love it. I just got back from the grocery store. I cleaned the inside of the fridge, like the whole entire inside before I left because I wanted to do like a fresh shop so I took out all of these like containers and washed all of them and then wiped down everything. Okay, I'm gonna do a little 
grocery haul before I put everything away. I'm so excited to get the fridge all stocked up since it's empty right now. But this is everything I got. I went to Whole Foods and then I also went to Walden Local, which is like the local butcher in the South End. And I love that place because they have like pasture-raised, grass-fed meats. Um, they also have fish. They have butter, eggs, bacon, like literally everything. It's so good. So if you live in Boston, definitely go check it out. But this is everything that I got. So I got this whole milk right here for coffee and lattes in the morning. And then I got these rolls right here, which I'm gonna do like chicken salad sandwiches with these. And then I got some of this grass-fed feta. I'm gonna make a Greek pasta salad. So I got this and then also some Dijon mustard. And then I picked up a few different flavors of the Olipop. I got the root beer, the vintage cola, and then I got this one, the orange squeeze, which a bunch of you guys had actually recommended the orange squeeze on my Instagram because I posted about how much I loved the Olipop root beer. And I got so many responses saying that the orange squeeze was your favorite. So I got that because I was like, I have to try it. And then I got chicken for, for the chicken salad, which I don't know why I didn't get chicken from the butcher because I already went there before I went to Whole Foods and I forgot. So I just picked up chicken at Whole Foods, got some romaine for salad and sandwiches. And then I got these sparkling waters, some chickpea pasta for the pasta salad. I got some spinach, celery, green onion, and then a New York strip, also some bacon, some eggs. And then over here is all of the fresh produce. Well, I got potatoes that I'm gonna make with the steak and a big salad, which you guys will see later. And then I got tomatoes, bell pepper for the pasta salad, bananas, onion, garlic, cucumber. And then I also got some of these broccoli microgreens for like breakfast in the morning and then also to put on the chicken salad sandwiches. And then I got some mushrooms, this Primal Kitchen Green Goddess dressing, lemons, and then some fresh herbs to do like a garlic, butter, and herb sauce on the steak. has gone down a little bit but i'm all cozy i'm laying in bed i'm gonna just lay and edit moving vlogs i'm gonna finish yesterday's vlog i have an hour and 35 minutes of footage and then i'm gonna start doing today's video and then get these up for you guys i've been like working as hard as i can to keep up with the vlogs as well as trying to get the house organized and stuff so i just want to give you guys a little update but yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. <laughs> so much better today oh, and I need to get ready because I'm leaving to go get my nails done in like 10 minutes I have to shower and head out my nails are so bad because I was like you know what I'm not gonna get them done before I move because also I'm out of breath from walking up the stairs <laughs> but I was like I'm not gonna get them done before I move because I'm gonna be like unpacking packing and just like using my hands so much that they're literally gonna chip and it's gonna be like pointless for me to 
get a manicure if they're just gonna like get ruined but you should see the state of them right now like they're so scary so i'm very excited to get my nails done also um oh i feel like i haven't really shown the bedroom i guess we can talk about it more later but i because i really have to go but i got new pillows these pillows are literally the best from amazon oh i talked about them yesterday anyway i just brought up the new pillows that i got from amazon that i showed you guys so i'm gonna put those on the bed and i also got a bunch of new stuff from revolve over here which i am gonna do a little try on haul once i get home but i really need to go shower and get ready also it's so hot out today it's like 80 degrees <laughs> and i'm like what is going on it's like almost the end of september and ooh. and it's just so hot still so anyway i can't wear any of my new clothes that i got because they're more like fall clothes but i just made a coffee i'm gonna shower and then i gotta go to my nail appointment but i just want to say good morning i'll talk to you guys in a little okay i'm leaving this is the outfit of the day i look like i'm wearing pajamas honestly i feel like it's because my hair is not done and it's wet from the shower but i'm wearing these slides from revolve set is from revolve as well and i don't even care that i look like i'm wearing pajamas because i'm literally going to the nail salon and i just don't care <laughs> hi guys i just got back from the nail salon and these are my nails i just got a navy blue gel you should have seen them before like they were so so bad like i couldn't even like it was just like the most cringy thing ever like you know when you don't have your nails done and they're just like breaking and gross that's what mine were like for literally a week straight and it was like stressing me out so bad so it feels so good to have a fresh manicure but i just got home to actually a bunch of packages which i am very excited about because i ordered a new knife set on amazon and these are called global knives and i got the seven piece set and it comes with a block and i was asking Graydon like which knives he recommends because the ones that i have now i've had for a few years and i'm going to give them to emma because i wanted like to get a full set and have like the block on the counter and everything because i cook so much so i was like you know what i need to upgrade my knife set because also the ones that i had before just like weren't sharp at all so i'm really excited about these and this is what they look like it came with oh seven like i just said and Ooh, we have this one right here for bread and stuff like that i don't even know where they go in this little block this one i think i'm missing one because it only came with one two three four five and the sharpener and there's space for two more knives <laughs> so i'm really confused about that um but anyway i also just brought this in from the car i've had this for like months and it's block oil for all of my wooden utensils and my cutting board over here which need to be oiled at least like once a month because it prevents them from like getting really dry and cracked and look how dry like i've never put oil on any of these and my cutting board i noticed that it was getting a few cracks in it so that's really bad i want to like avoid <laughs> getting more so i'm going to oil those up in a couple of minutes and i just had one more package to open i'm going to restock the fridge because poppy just sent over a huge box of their root beer they actually sent over three boxes the root beer and then the classic cola of their drinks and then they also sent this one over as well which is i think great but these two are my favorite i'm so excited
okay, this is your sign to order some block oil and oil your wooden utensils and cutting boards if you have them. It's so, so important because it literally makes them look brand new. And also, I'm just like really nervous about the cracks now that I have in my cutting board. You definitely want to avoid all of that. So I will link <laughs> some block oil down below and it's super easy, it takes 10 minutes and it just keeps your wooden utensils and cutting boards lasting so much longer. Hello you guys, sorry my hair is literally a mess right now. Um, I just got back from the old apartment. There's like still some boxes and stuff in the storage unit which Mac and I were trying to clean out and just like bring some stuff over here because we had left stuff and we were like you know what on the moving day um we were just like we're just gonna go back and get it next week since i had my apartment i have my apartment until the end of september i paid through september so technically we didn't have to be out right away but anyway so we just did that and oh my leg hurts so bad you guys like i don't know what i did but the back of my leg i like pulled a muscle on the back of my like knee like where that area is and it just like makes the front of my knee hurt and it makes my calf hurt and it makes my hamstring hurt and i don't know if like what happened but it just kills and i don't know why <laughs> But it's made things super difficult because I have a lot to do around the house and I just like can barely walk and this place is four floors so it's like up and down, up and down the stairs and I have been like struggling so bad but maybe it's just God's way of being like Maggie, you need to take a break because you've been doing too much since you moved in and I think he's right. I just opened up a package from Amazon. I've been ordering so much Amazon. Got a water filter. And I used to have this one at my, not my last apartment, but the apartment before that I lived in because I didn't have a water filter in my fridge. And at my last apartment, I was fortunate enough to have water, like a filter in the fridge, which was really cool. And this apartment doesn't have one in the fridge, so I ordered this water filter again. And I really like it. I don't love that it's plastic, but it honestly is the biggest one that I could find. There was a different one that was glass that I used to have, but it's just so small. And if you drink a lot of water, it's just like not that practical. But I will link this down below you guys are interested i'm making pasta salad and chicken salad right now i'm just gonna start prepping the vegetables for the pasta salad i'm using this pasta right here and i'm gonna do bell pepper cucumber feta red onion and then probably maybe tomato but i'm gonna make a homemade dressing i think like a greek dressing or maybe an italian dressing to go in the pasta salad and i'm also gonna bake some chicken breasts right now because I'm gonna make a chicken salad and I got green onion and celery for that. So I have the oven preheated to, well it's preheating right now to 425 and I'm gonna cook the chicken for like 20 minutes and then shred it up for the chicken salad. <gasps> oh. Guys, I'm using my new knives that I got. Like, these are so sharp, it cuts this pepper like butter. This is crazy. downpouring right now but i'm gonna end off this vlog with a revolve haul which i'm very excited about because i got a few cute pieces for fall and i'll have everything linked down below i wore one of the sets the silk set i got that from revolve and then also my um 
slides from Rome like the puffy sides those are revolve as well so i got those and oh i also got a pair of earrings which let me go grab because they're in my jewelry box and i don't want to forget to include them okay so yeah these are the earrings and they're so cute i'm obsessed with them and i just feel like they're really cute for like fall and then i also got this shirt right here from citizens of humanity i got it in a size medium I think and it's just like a blue button-up shirt which I feel like you can really never go wrong because sometimes it's like too hot to wear a jacket and I just want to like throw something on that is like long sleeve and cute so I got this let me see if this angle works if you guys can see okay so yeah this is what the shirt looks like I like the size i'm glad that i got a medium and you could totally do like a one button with like a pair of jeans it's a little bit long in the back though but it's still really cute okay then i got this jacket right here which i am obsessed with it's from anim bing and i got this also in a size medium but it's just a little zip up that's like fuzzy brown fuzzy and i love how it's like leather right here has a little pocket and it also has pockets on the side they aren't zipper which i'm kind of sad about because i love like putting things in my pocket and like knowing that they're not gonna fall out but this is how the medium fits i'm really happy also that i got the medium instead of the large because i do like wearing stuff oversized i just feel like the large would have been a little bit too big and this is so cute you can like wear it so many different ways i love just like throwing on jackets like this over like workout clothes and going to a workout in the fall and i know that i think that this also comes in a different color as well i'm not sure if they have it on revolve but they have it a lighter brown too and then i got this leather jacket right here in a size large this is the brand and i love this leather jacket, I was gonna get it for fashion week, but I was like, you know what, it's way too hot. So I just waited and had it delivered once I got home. And this is what it looks like. I love the fit of the large because it just like gives you so much more room. I If I went down to a medium, it definitely would be like more fitted, but the large is very comfy. I love the detailing and just like the vintage look of this jacket. I can't wait to style it. For fall it is pricey but i just think that it's a really great piece and great investment because you can wear it year after year it's really honestly worth it to invest in a good leather jacket and i don't have a brown one like this so i'm really excited and then i also just got a new pair of black javiana flip-flops i love just throwing these on and i got these so i could like have another pair to keep in the closet for when i just go out and walk the dogs but yeah these are like my favorite flip-flops and then i got these pants right here which i need to try on i got two pairs of pants these are i mean bang i think that they're called the max pant and they just look like this and they have a slit on the bottom i got them in a size four let me try them on and see how they fit okay these are the pants they fit so well i'm glad that i got a four and not a six because they are stretchy and they do have a little slit like up the side which i think is really cute they would look really good with like a blazer and a pair of black heels or something or even like boots <laughs> i love these i love the fit so much and then i got these jeans right here from Anim Bing as well and I love the fit of these. I got them in a 28 and I just cuffed them a little bit at the bottom. They do have like a raw hem which I really like but they are a little bit long. I just love the fit of them. I love the distressing and if you guys couldn't tell like this is my favorite brand at the moment. I've been looking for a really good pair of denim and I'm really happy about these ones. I just love how they fit and everything and then i also got this little hat which i will try on for you guys because i posted it on instagram and i got so many <laughs> dms being like can you try this hat on so this is what it looks like just little 
brown beanie. <laughs> okay, I feel like it makes my head look like a mushroom. Um, I still think it's really cute and I really like it. I did get one more item. Actually, last but not least, I just wore these today and they're a little bit dirty, but I got these APL sneakers. I'm obsessed. These are pricey as well, but like more than normal APLs, um, but they are like running shoes. Love the look of them. I love how they're like not a bright white. They might look bright white on camera, but they're kind of like a creamy off-white i love the black i love the material they're very comfy they have a lot of support i can't wait to run in these and work out in them i feel like getting new workout clothes like makes me so inspired <laughs> to work out so i'm really excited about these um but yeah if you guys want to check out anything that i got any of these pieces i will have them all linked down below like i said i'm gonna clean up all these clothes get new bed sheets put on the bed start the day i'm starting off a new vlog today actually so stay tuned for that make sure you're subscribed to my channel so you don't miss out on any upcoming vlogs also i did want to say thank you to everybody who left a comment on my last video whether you were like congratulating me on the new house or giving um like your ideas and input on like what to do in certain spaces i really appreciated that and it was so helpful and i just can't wait for you guys to see the house all finished i will show in the next vlog just like some updates and stuff because it has been almost a week living here and i feel like everything is like starting to look really good and is starting to like get all unpacked and stuff so i can't wait for you guys to see that and yeah so i love you guys thank you so much for watching again and i will see you in my next video bye